Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Unlock Your Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICSC Maths today, uh, class 7, chapter 10, Linear Inequalities, exercise 10a. So friends, without wasting any time, let us begin. Now this is, write down the values of x that are integers and satisfy these inequalities. Now you can see that some inequalities are given to us and we have to write down the value of the x here. Alright, and satisfy these inequalities. Now friends, first of all, we read the inequality first one. x is greater than 1 and x is less than 4. Now, see the value of x has to be more than 1 and less than 4. If you are still not able to understand, you can take the help of a number line. Um, just a demonstration I am giving you here. 1, 2, 3 and 4. So you can see that value of x has to be more than 1 right more than 1 and it has to be less than 4 so these two numbers the value of x will be any one out of these two numbers that is 2 and 3 now how to write this for friends you we need to know something that is curly brackets all right so these are basically brackets but curly and we use them to make sets and in that set we will write the number or you can see the set of the numbers which will represent the value of that x so like for the answer part here you can write this okay first you open the curly bracket and write the two numbers which you think that represent the value of x here so that is 2 and 3 so 2 comma 3 and then you close it so that is that simple and we have found our answer this is 2 and 3 now the next part is x is greater than 0 and x is less than 5 again here you see that value of x has to be more than 0 and it has to be less than 5 so now if you are able to understand you can simply visualize that what numbers come between 0 and 5 because if you understand the question the value of x is basically the numbers coming between 0 and 5 so first of all what we will do is that we will open the curly brackets and now think of the numbers so start from the smallest number you see now you see over here like x is greater than 0 so after 0 we have 1 then we have 2 then we have 3 and then 4 now why we are not writing over here 0 and 5 because for 0 x has to be more than that and for 5 x has to be less than that now simply you can just close the bracket here right so this is our answer of the second question and now the third part is x is more than 5 or you can say greater than 5 and x is less than 10 now again here you see that value of x has to be more than 5 so in the answer we can write here that first of all open the curly brackets up and you see x is more than 5 so you start from 6 7 8 now 9 will be the last last number and then you close it why 9 is the last number because x has to be less than 10 so we cannot write 10 so this is the answer now the next part is x is greater than 25 and x is less than 32 so again over here you will see that the value of x has to be more than 25 so you can start writing the, your answers by opening the set and then writing the numbers after 25 so first of all we have 26 then 27 28 29 30 31 and you close it again we have closed it at 31 because x has to be less than what this 32 right so you close it at 31 let us move on to the next part now next part is x is less than 4 and x is greater than minus 2 so again friends over here you can start making your answer by opening the curly brackets and friends you see here we have a negative number so if you are getting confusion remember that make a number line and represent these numbers on that number line so you can make one okay i will also make one to basically clear your doubts because this time we have a negative number so minus one mi uh, minus two minus one zero and it is still four so we take it till one two three and four 
now you see here over friends what do you see that this tells us that va value of x has to be less than 4 so you, it goes here then it is saying it has to be more than minus 2 so it comes here so numbers between these will come in our uh, set that will be the solution and now you see here that from what number will we start writing I have said that always start writing from the smallest number right so smallest number will be the negative number so first of all we will write minus 1 then we will write 0 then 1 then 2 and then 3 and then simply close this set right so you can see that this is the answer of our uh, question let's move on to the next part now the next part x is less than 3 and x is greater than minus 4 so over here again you can start writing your answer by first of all opening your set up you see that x is greater than minus 4 so we start writing the numbers which are greater than minus 4 that is minus 3 minus 2 minus 1 0 1 and 2 all right and then the comma right so you see over here that this uh, x has to be less than 3 here so we have this 2 over here which is representing the value that x is less than that right so this is the answer of our sixth and the final part of this question and friends this is all for today if you are new to my youtube channel do not forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon down below so that you get notified whenever i upload a new video also leave a like on this video till then stay home stay safe wear a mask maintain social distancing and take good care of yourself bye bye